Okay, Grandpa Louie, the question is, what advice do you have for Roberto, who is turning nine years old tomorrow as a 97-year-old man? What advice do you have for this man right here? My goodness, how old are you going to be? Nine. Nine years old. My goodness, I can remember when I was nine years old. I, I, you know what I was doing? I used to live with my grandmother because my mom and dad, they, we used to go up north to work in the cotton fields and the grape, grape, cut grapes and so they left me at home and everything. And my grandma had me, we go to church every single day because I, go, I wasn't going to school yet and I was out there. And what they had over there, they had on Sundays, had girls take flowers to the altar in the church. So my grandma said, he give him flowers so he can take the flowers. So I was the only boy in that, a group of maybe a dozen young, young girls. I had it made because I had all these girls around me. <laughs> And that's what I was doing when I was nine years old. And I was always happy with your grandma because she didn't understand English and my Spanish wasn't that good either. <laughs> but we, we made up, we made up. And I was the only one because I was the youngest. So it kept me all that heavy work from doing, but I had a nice time. So. You do and whatever your mom and your daddy tells you to do, there's a good reason for that. So that you can turn to be a real good, good son. Okay? All right. You'll be a good boy. And you'll live, you what? You're going to live to be 97 years someday. And, it, when, and when you do that, you remember me, okay? And a boy. Mama can take a picture and then when you get a wallet, Get the picture carried with you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome.